All right, we have a 2016 Cadillac ATS-V here that I think the owner picked up used. I don't know how long he's had it. The car's in really good shape. Had a couple of rock chips up front on the hood. Uh, I'm not sure if maybe the bumper had been redone because that was in really, really good condition. And usually after four years of driving around it, you know, wouldn't be this clean. Anyway, this client actually came all the way from um, Key West, or I think he's very close to Key West. So it took him three and a half hours to get the car to the shop. And the car was um, you know, brought in for paint correction first, and um, then Expel PPF was supplied to the front clip, which would be everything on the, from the fenders forward and the side view mirrors hood, bumper, um, you know, the headlights, like I said, fenders, and then everything was ceramic coated, the PPF and the, uh, and the paint. Uh, the wheels were, were also removed, completely cleaned up, prepped, and then ceramic coated, as well as um, the calipers. The interior was left alone, just a regular cleaning. And then the uh, windshield also got ceramic coated. The car's in really, really good condition. And uh, I also think, you know, silver looks pretty good on this car. I mean, gen in general, I'm not really a big fan of silver. But uh, it, it definitely, definitely fits certain models pretty well. And I think this car is one of those. So... Anyway, the car looks really shiny. It's um, completely protected now. It's a good looking car. The owner should be able to enjoy this for quite some time to come. Let's take a look at the interior. Like I said, nothing was coated on the inside, but you know, but the car really is in, is in uh, remarkable condition. Comfortable looking seats. Some fake carbon fiber appointments on the inside, but you know, still looks decent. And as usual, like I always point out, because I'm not sure who sees all the old videos, but it's very difficult to um, to distinguish between where the car has PPF and where it doesn't. Like on the fender here, this is covered in PPF with ceramic coating, and then the door is just ceramic coated. And there's no difference in the finish at all. I mean, if you get up really close to the car, you'll see some small telltale signs of, you know, maybe a plasticky finish, something that's in the material itself, but overall, I would say 99 out of 100 people could never tell that part of the car is um, um, covered in Expel. And if the whole car is done, and for sure people cannot tell the difference, especially after the ceramic coating gets applied also. So this car should be getting picked up tomorrow. He has a three and a half hour trip back home, but now he's uh, well protected and everything should be good, should be easy to clean, and he should be able to enjoy this car for quite some time.